What's up, my love bugs and love muffins? What's up, my love bugs muffin? Today we get a do a gingerbread. He get to make it. Yeah, he want to do a gingerbread prank. Yeah. Oh, me, 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 me. I thought she sounded like you. Yeah. I love you, old oh man. I love you too, man. You're my best friend. Yeah. Oh my goodness, that's my son. What you doing, old oh man? I'm right here talking to you, man. Hugging to you, me. Me and old man. Old man. Old man. A old man. Um, it's two onions. It's two onions, man. Yeah. yeah. I'm on man the second. On man at home, man, sitting in the window. Oh. You, you, you Ooh, want me? Eggs is packs is melts is hell. Hey. <laughs> What'd you say? I don't know what I just said. I love that song. Me too. Take me deep in my feet could ever want to. I hope I don't wake up in the middle of the night and my stomach hurts. How many of y'all snore? Raise your hand. Oh, I think That's I'm crazy because I can't see y'all hands. But if y'all snore, like, get that checked out. They could be sleep apnea. Your tonsils, your tonsils could be in the way. What you say, CJ? Mm. What to do? Sorry, Sorry, mommy. You didn't do nothing, baby. Oh, I love you. I love you too. What? CJ. CJ. You're special, kid. You're all special. Both of y'all are special. Thank you, but I'm jealous of CJ here because mine can't get curly like that no more. Yeah, I can, Queen. Just gotta put stuff in it. Gotta put the stuff in there. Hey, old man. Wow. What are you doing, old man? I'm growling at the camera. Wow. Right. CJ wanted to do a video, y'all. This is his video. He wanted to do a gingerbread prank. Yeah, this is my video. So we need so pretty. So um, what are we gonna do? We gotta make a gingerbread. Bread prank, you hear me, y'all? So how we gonna do it? On the game, we huh? can build it like this. Ooh. And we can scratch it, and we can eat it, man. Mm. Let me tell y'all this gingerbread, gingerbread story. You wanna hear a gingerbread story, to, uh, yeah. CJ? Yeah. Okay, so when I was a little girl, y'all, I'm gonna tell y'all my gingerbread story. It's sad. I told my kids about it when they was younger. They felt sorry for me, but I was telling the truth. When I was a little girl, I was in first grade. I don't know. My teacher's name was Mrs. Post in West Willow. I went to at West Willow Elementary, and I never knew why she was so mean to me. She never liked me. It seemed like I was always picked on all the time. But anyway, everybody in the classroom, we got together and we baked a gingerbread man. And remember the story of the gingerbread man, how he oh, ran away? Oh, Mom, you better tell that story. Yeah. Oh, they don't give you no gingerbread. Yeah, everybody got a piece of gingerbread. She passed out a piece of the gingerbread, and every, everybody got a piece of gingerbread but me. I was the only one in the classroom out of all the kids. My why? I don't know. I don't know why she did that. Oh, to give me, give me, give me your hand. Thank you. I never you knew sad. why she made me feel like that. You, you know that stuck with me as a child. That's why you. you sad. Huh? Yeah, I'm fat. Why? 
Because <laughs> Nani eat. Hey, you know what? I told CJ he couldn't have no Diet Pepsi because it's for fat people. But Daddy, it's true. Why are you sad? Well, he say sad? Yeah. You didn't say fat. You said sad. Yeah, I was sad because I'm going to tell y'all a story. You got to be careful what you do to little kids. Because they remember. They remember stuff. And here I am, 49 years old. But I remember as a little kid in first grade how she did me with that gingerbread man. It's not the fact that I didn't get a piece of gingerbread. It's not the fact of that. It's the fact that why I why I did how she made me out of all those kids I stood out. I, why was I? It made me go home and feel like why 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 was I the only one who couldn't have it? Who who couldn't have a piece of the gingerbread? It made me feel like that. Why you can't have a piece of gingerbread? Because it was being mean. It was being mean. I think it's because I didn't have my hands on the desk. Everybody's supposed to have their hands on the desk. I think, I'm not mistaken, that's what it was. But if I did it, she could have gave me a chance. Like, I said, okay, you know, I'm gonna come back next time around, have your hands on the mm -hmm. desk like I asked you. She don't make a kid feel like that. She did that to be mean to me. She was always mean to me. <laughs> If I, t if I seen that lady today, and then I had this one one teacher, her name was Mrs. Mrs. Huff, and she used to always hit me with a fly swatter. She used to go around the classroom in fourth grade and find reasons to hit people. Boy, I wasn't the only one who complained about her. There's a lot of people complained about her. And she, um, she, she would find reasons to hit us. Like, for example, she called the, this girl in front of the class named Cherie. And she would ask Cherie, because Cherie was kind of special. She would ask, she asked Cherie one day, she, I guess she had time on her hands. She asked Cherie, she was like, who in this classroom will always pick on you? And Cherie pointed out a couple people. Do you know she called those kids up there and gave them a swat in front of the whole class? But it's like, who does that? Like, you're supposed to be teaching us stuff. And you, no, she ain't, she ain't, she ain't with me, because I didn't pick on Cherie, but. It, yeah. My teacher, my second grade, Miss Jackson, she whooped me in class. In class? Why? Yeah, she beat me in a circle. What her beat you at? In the butt? Yeah, she hit me with the belt on, on my butt, yep. Because she asked me not to sit by Deanna no more. And I didn't sit by Deanna, I sat by Diana. She thought I was getting smart. But then, I, then I tell you not to sit by, uh, I said, you told me not to sit by Deanna. You didn't say I couldn't sit by Diana. And she whipped me in front of the whole class. You crying? Boy, my mother go up there and let her have it. Stinky. Daddy, you crying? Yeah, I was crying. She had me hollering. She beat me like I was really her grandchild. Oh, you pulling your pajamas? And what's funny? Yeah. She was a drunk. Honestly, I had that woman teaching little second graders. Oh, she was a drunk. Cause Ew. She, cause she smelled. Cause she smelled like what? it. What? She had alcohol. On her. She was a smoker. Come here, baby. And I would walk past and see her in the teachers, the conference room, and they'd be in there smoking. Come here, baby. That was my story, y'all. I don't know why I just told the stories about, you know, back in the day, teachers was able to hit on you and stuff. Yeah, I wonder how that had, like, that, that can't be. Yeah, that's that. But I uh, dared any one of them to touch that's mine. That. Huh? That's that. Yeah, that's sad, CJ. Make a, um, story that. Oh, you Daddy. Got a little popsicle neck. <laughs> Mike, I will popsicle. Mm -hmm. you it's that popsicle home. You want. It's that home you don't have nothing here. Oh, he's so cute when he talks. Queen helped me tonight. So, anyway, I was Nani, sitting in Nani, a... guess what? Mm -hmm. I get to help you make a gingerbread. You're going to help me make a gingerbread since it got took from me? Yeah. Oh, I love you so much, CJ. That was nice. <laughs> Gummy. <laughs> Gummy, it's bro. so cute. Thumbs up, guys. Make sure down below all the making gingerbread. All right. Oh, he is such a YouTuber. So yes. Say, he ended down the video. Like and comment. Like and comment. Okay, I got it. Love you guys. Now do this. Love you guys. Do this. No, you gotta do it longer. Okay. Don't touch this.
ಇವಾಗ